only thing that I know for sure that I can change is myself. I cannot control or change people, places, and things. I can control myself. So that's where the inner work comes in. And that's how I've grown and transformed and evolved. But going back to how do the parents and the teachers, if they don't even have the awareness of these patterns, have the awareness that they're in this victim place to even do the work. So I have a vision of wanting to go to PTA meetings, professional development days, any way, shape, or form to get in front of parents and educators to talk about masks and to talk yeah. about the problem and yeah. the solution, the prison to the paradise. Yes. yes. Okay. This is so, I just had this memory of Dr. Shafali when I went to Evolve probably like five years ago. Mm -hmm. And I did the Monday meditation and on the last day we spent seven hours in silence more or less. And the last hour we did some sort of activity. And I remember her saying to us over and over and over again, that we all had to say it out loud. You can't change everyone. Mm -hmm. She's like, you can't change. say it again. You can't change. You can't change everyone. And you have to help those that are ready to be helped. And she kept having us say it out loud because as you were talking, I was thinking about how we have to trust that those that are ready to wake up will wake up when they're ready to wake up. Right. Mm -hmm. And we can't actually necessarily change that. However, we can hope that we find the people that are ready to wake up and that maybe we resonate with them and we're put in their pathway. 